Do you notice a difference in, in regards kind of the way that uh, ladies football and camogie and, and ladies sports in general in Cork is portrayed now and, and um, publicised a bit more in the newspapers and on the, the media? Have you noticed a, a change in that? Yeah, definitely. I, I mean, C103 and the Southern Star have been absolutely fantastic for, for coverage over the last number of years. Um, we wouldn't have gotten that when I was when I was younger. Um, but you'd hear loads of different sports, not just GA and ladies football and camogie and stuff, but it's, it's all the sports. Um, but definitely there's been a huge improvement in it and it's great because it's kind of encouraging young girls to maybe join up a sport and, and see that the opportunity is there for them as well. And would you see over at your own uh, club in Kinsale a big difference with we'll say this time of the year uh, new members coming in again in, the, in the, the girls section that there's more girls after success like yourself wanting to join the club and be part of that? Yeah last year in Kinsale we had a fantastic year getting to an All-Ireland final like the year before we lost the county final which was a huge disappointment for us and I suppose last year there was huge interest um, in the club and even all around the town like the people were just so proud of the club and there's new girls even joined this year there's a new camogie club set up in Kinsale for adult age and it's just progressing and it's, it's brilliant. Um, and what's, uh, what's the aim for the year ahead for, for yourself personally and for the team? Yeah well with Kinsale we're up intermediate now this year um, which will be a big set step up um, but a nice challenge facing us um, so I suppose just kind of maybe hoping to get, get on good there like you know and just drive on keep working hard um, with Kinsale, that's what can say with Cork I suppose where you'd always be hoping to be back in Quogue Park in the, on the last weekend in September winning another All-Ireland final but I suppose we'll have to wait and see what, what comes our way. Do you, do you find with the history of, of Cork being so successful with the All-Ireland that there, there's pressure nearly more pressure every year to keep it up? There is pressure but I suppose you can put the pressure on yourselves you know management are just so happy with us like we, we try our hardest at training and stuff and we push on but this coming year now I'm afraid that we could have a few retirements um, which may, means that the younger girls we need to start stepping up and you know showing that we can do it there's brilliant underage coming up and there is it's there for us in Cork the ladies football is very strong. Perfect well thank you very much for speaking yeah. with us and enjoy the rest of the night. Thanks a million. Thank you.